Texas City Council tonight voted to close down the Cuckoo's Nest Rock Club, the only punk rock club in town. Ross Becker has the story. For the young people in the audience at tonight's council meeting, the issue was the survival of punk rock and their place to enjoy it. For the management of Costa Mesa's only punk rock club, the outcome of the meeting could mean the survival of their business. The city council had to decide if the stories of bottle throwing, fighting, vandalism, and underage drinking at the Cuckoo's Nest are true. The owner of the Cuckoo's Nest told the council his club is being harassed, that he's tried to cooperate with the police and the club's neighbors, but he said there seems to be another reason for what he calls an assault on the social phenomenon. Club employees and patrons told the same story, but the police and some of the club neighbors think the problem is not punk rock, but the punk rockers, the ones who they say are causing trouble. People being extremely loud. What I mean by loud is just uh, out, out really just screaming, yelling. Uh, definitely would attract your attention if you're any, anywhere in the area. Uh, broken beer bottles all over the place. The council listened. They listened for more than two hours. Then they had to decide. Councilman Don Hall said the problem will not go away. And Councilman Ed McFarland told the overflow crowd, don't blame us, we didn't create the problem at the Cuckoo's Nest. The young people left before the vote. It was obvious they lost. Cuckoo's Nest is closed for tonight. It was a four to nothing vote of the city council, but the manager says it won't be for long. He's taking the case to the Superior Court here in Orange County. He says it's a constitutional issue, and the city council should not be allowed to ban punk rock. They tried to get rid of me. 